All right, let's go ahead and correct our sentence today. Do not forget, we have our mountain here. That reminds us that we start every sentence with a capital letter. If you notice, I did not start this sentence with a capital letter, just like yesterday. So you should have changed it to a capital S. The mountain reminds us every sentence starts with a capital letter. I also intentionally left off our ending mark. So this sentence format right here reminds you, start with a capital, end with a period. Every time you finish your thought that you write, you need to have an ending mark. All right, so let's start with our who or what is this sentence about? That is our subject. It is going to be a noun. It is a person, place, or thing. So today our sentence says, snow fell silently from the sky last night. Oh, I wish it did. We had rain though. I would love to have snow. Snow is what our sentence is about. That is the what in our sentence. Now I ask myself for my action, what did my subject do? The snow, what did it do? Yep, it fell. Now I go down to my question words. How do I expand my sentence in order to make my sentence stronger and bigger and better? Well, I start with how. Do I know how the snow fell? I sure do, it's right here. How did it fall? Yep, silently. Do I know where the snow fell? Yes, I do. It fell from the sky. So I wanna write where to remind me. Do I know when the snow fell? As you guessed, we know that as well. That is last night. So my sentence, snow fell silently from the sky last night. I was able to take my, sub my subject and my verb, snow fell. That's a simple sentence right there. And I made my sentence a lot stronger and better by putting my expanders in. I made my sentence longer by telling me how snow fell, where the snow fell, and when the snow fell. Starting next week, I am going to start you with a sentence. You are going to have to fill in some of these sentence expanders to make sure that you also are able to expand a sentence. Great job today, and I look forward to seeing what kind of sentences you can create all by yourself next week.